My name is Marlene Loney. I was born in February 3rd, 1960, and I'm a Canadian and live in beautiful British Columbia. I run a fishing lodge in the Canadian wilderness, and I'm also a show promoter, but what I do is share the Canadian wilderness with people and teach them to enjoy what we have here and to engage in nature. And I also, my other job is to connect artisans um, with consumers and enrich people's lives with that other thing. So I'm, what do I do? I, I bring people together. My greatest success in life is recognizing when I find a good thing. And Caver Hill Lodge, and Caver Hill is an amazing good thing, as is my partner, Larry. All right. <laughs> <laughs> right. It's the recognizing it. Yeah. It's, it's the seeing it. That's, that's my greatest success, it's seeing it. I'm a positive person by nature, and I think failure to dwell on it is never a good thing to do. I think your mistakes are paths to grow from. So there is no such thing as failure, as long as you move forward from whatever happens. So I have no failures. I've made mistakes and have moved forward in a positive direction, I hope. Sometimes I've made the same mistake repeatedly, but I have had no failures because I think I've always grown from everything that's happened in my life. Money is security and freedom, um, choice, and I think we are lucky to have that advantage, but it is never things and it is never power for me. Over the next 10 years, I would like to travel lots. I would like to continue caring for my parents and I would truly like to continue running the fishing lodge and sharing more laughter with people and teaching more people how to fish and enjoy nature and really doing what I am currently doing. I feel happy with where I am in life and happy to continue doing what I do. I believe in nature's ability to heal most things um, in people. And I think I believe in, in the goodness in most people and the ability to find, um, sometimes with hard work, the good in most people. And I believe it's important to be kind and nice and loving as much as you can most of the time. Uh, that is a sad question because I feel that if um, the person that built the earth, if such a thing happened, could reconsider he wouldn't have put humans on the earth because we've done little that is good for the earth or nothing that is good for the earth. And I think we are a very sad experiment that went wrong and perhaps it would be best for us not to be here. But seeing as how we are here, I hope we try to improve the earth as much as we can. I don't believe we deserve another planet. If we ruin this one, I think we should go down with the planet. I live because I think someone needs to stop and feel the sunshine or the raindrops and to take joy in the small things that nature has to offer. And sometimes I think we're too busy running around making money and being busy. Um, and I think we need to stop. So I think it's my job is to stop and feel the sunshine. And I try to remember that when I'm busy running. All right. Thank you. You're welcome. Bye. <laughs>